click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous lecture we have discussed about the structure of ozone and now in this topic we are going to talk about the uses of ozone. So what are the uses? Let me talk about that in this topic. So friends, talking about the uses of ozone, we understand that is ozone plays a very vital role in protecting the earth from the harmful UV rays that comes through the sun. And that is the biggest use, that is what we know. But there are other uses also, that is what I want to talk about. So let me talk about the first point here, that is, it is used as a disinfectant as well as germicides. So that is the reason that is ozone is also very poisonous in nature. If it has been consumed or suppose if it is basically present in any kind of matter, it could be toxic in nature. And talking about the next point, that is, it is used as a bleaching agent for starch, flour, oil, wax, etc. Okay, about the next point that is it is also used for the sterilization of air and water that is for the purification of air and water also so as to kill the bacteria also to kill the other microorganisms that would be very harmful for us and talking okay, about the next one that is the ozone is used in the manufacturing of camera 4 that is potassium permanganate along with that of it is also used in the preparation of artificial silk and synthetic camphor so these are the certain industrial uses that is what i have discussed about here so now that's it so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood the uses of ozone and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe ek channel thank you so much